Check back in with meteorologist Dave Nussbaum. Apparently, spring is happening later today, but it doesn't quite feel like it out there, Dave. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Take a look at these low temperatures this morning. Hatleyville, 17 degrees. Gadsden was at 20, Jasper 21, Bessemer 22. Birmingham got down to 23 degrees uh, unofficially. We'll get the climate report for Birmingham later, but during the hourly obs, did get down there to 23, so pretty cold. Normally, we should be right around 46, so way below that. Now, spring doesn't arrive until really 424, so I guess it's still winter time, and so it can be this cold. Uh, but moving forward, though, we will have more spring like weather later this week. Right now, though, we are talking about some high clouds coming in. You can see from our BJCC camera, 44 degrees out there. Again, on average, our lows should be in the mid 40s. We're not even there yet here uh, at this lunch hour. 45 Alabaster, Tuscaloosa, Moundville, Jasper area. They're back to Talladega. 42 in Gadsden. Now, Coleman at 43. You were down about 18 this morning there. And Montgomery at 48. 50 down along the coast. Panama City, 51. Those on spring break at the beach. It's so warm down there uh, as we have some cold. They're just about everywhere across the deep south as high pressure builds over top of us. You have that sinking air and still drawing down the colder air from the north here, but we will see some cloud cover. You can see behind it here with those suddenly winds back in Louisiana and Texas. That's going to help to warm us up as that high slides to the east of us later on this week. So 48 at 1 o'clock, 55 by 3 o'clock. Dinner time temperatures about 49 degrees out there. And we'll get to around 55 here, 57 Tuscaloosa, Moundville, Jasper area back to Gadsden and in Anderson, Alabaster, Clanton, about 56. And again, we should be around 68 typically for highs this afternoon. The kids have practiced this afternoon about 54 at 5 o'clock, falling to 49 at 7 by 9 o'clock down to 44. So bundle them up if they're going to their soccer or baseball practices. Lows tonight, 29 Fayette to Jasper area, 27 Asheville. We're at freezing. Same for Alabaster to Clanton and Tuscaloosa. So definitely going to be dealing with a freeze one more night. New freeze warning in effect here from 1 a.m. till 8 a.m. to so protect those plants again. Again. Then tomorrow we rebound from freezing up to the lower 60s in the afternoon. It's a little bit warmer out there. It stays dry Wednesday and Thursday, but Friday our chance of rain going to increase later in the day. 60% about 100% chance overnight. Another shot of rain on Sunday. Severe threat on Friday and early Saturday morning off to our west. Likely a line of storms will be coming in. It could be weakening as it gets here. As you'll see as we go through the evening hours here by 10 o'clock in northwestern Alabama. As it gets to Birmingham middle of the night around 1 a.m. Then by say 4 o'clock in the morning. Those storms are from Montgomery to the Atlanta area and then clearing they're out for Saturday and the weather starts to improve with some sunshine by Saturday afternoon. So the warming trend will continue 70s Wednesday, 80s Thursday and Friday with that strong storm threat late in the day. So we need to keep a close eye on those drying out Saturday before a few showers return on Sunday.